this first week of the new academic year, last night we talked with Penn State President Eric Barron. I'd like to continue the theme tonight by focusing on the experiences of a group of undergraduate students who are special to me, our incoming freshman meteorology majors. Many of the new meteorology students arrived a week ago to attend an event called TOTEMS, which stands for Total Orientation to Earth and Mineral Sciences. It's a three-day program for incoming freshmen in the College of EMS, held at a lake about an hour from State College. Coincidentally, President Barron created TOTEMS in 2003 when he was dean of the college. Most incoming freshman meteorology majors take five courses in their first semester, typically a first-year seminar, a chemistry class, a math class, often Calculus I, a general education course, and a class that I teach, Meteorology 201, Introduction to Weather Analysis. Lectures are bright and early on Monday and Wednesday at 8 a.m., then a two-hour lab session on Friday. Because school began on Monday, my class was, for most students, literally their first college experience. The first week of the semester is often called Syllabus Week, the implication being that you don't do much the first few days. That's not how my class works. Yes, I spend 20 minutes on Monday talking about the textbook, my office hours, how their grade is determined, for example. But then we did meteorology, starting with the challenges of taking the 3D surface of the Earth and flattening it onto a two-dimensional map. Topics included polar stereographic and Mercator map projections. Then we talked about measuring time, meteorology style. With 24 time zones on the planet, meteorologists who look at data worldwide don't use local times because it would be too confusing. Instead, we use a standardized 24-hour clock called Greenwich Mean Time, also known as UTC or Z time, that meteorology students have to get used to. In our second class today, I introduced the fundamental weather variables, pressure, temperature, density, humidity, wind direction, wind speed, and vertical velocity, and then went over the three temperature scales. I tell my students that they need to learn to speak fluent Celsius. Here's what a few of our freshman meteorology students had to say about their first few days of college. Totems definitely prepared me not only for my first day of class, but for all of college. I met so many people there. Every single one of the friends I've met there have like similar interests as me. and. It was really nice to meet faculty and alumni. I love all of my classes so far. Granted, I haven't gotten much homework yet or gone through any exams, but I really don't see that being an in, in issue in the future. It was interesting to see the pace of the class because high school is a little bit slower, but for uh, college, you're going to have about three classes per week and you're going to have to be able to be on top of things in order to get the information. It was, it was really um, interesting just to see what the course layout was going to look like. It really made me excited to actually start learning about something that I love to do. It's always an honor and a fun experience for me to teach these passionate, engaged newcomers to our field. Stay tuned. The extended forecast is next.